Okay, we need to talk to the mayor. What to do? What to do? I can't send the mine chieftains to exterminate those monsters. That'd be an execution. Good afternoon, Mayor Bixen. Special support section here. Oh, you came. I was hoping that you'd get here soon. You submitted a re support request, right? Something about monsters in the mine? Yes, we're in a bit of a pickle. D deep in the mine, there's an abandoned area that has already been fully excavated. Last night, monsters began a rampage in there, causing our mining crew problems. Monsters running amok in the mine definitely doesn't sound safe. Does that sort of thing happen often? Usually, many monsters appear in the areas where Septium is mined. You'd be hard-pressed to find a country that doesn't have that issue. That hasn't been explained yet. Monsters are naturally attracted to Septium crystals. I've heard that before a, lo uh, that before a lot of times. The, the suckers can't get enough of it. I think I remember learning about th that as well. No matter the country, mines always face the risk of attracting monsters. So that's how it is. Normally our miners are tough enough to be able to drive away monsters without any issues, but most of the miners are in the city, celebrating the anniversary festival. We're short on manpower. The abandoned mine entrance may be locked, but there's no telling how dangerous things will get if left unattended. And if you'd accept, I'd like for you folks to exterminate all the monsters in there. So what do you think? Understood. We'll take care of these monsters for you, no problem. Really? I'm in your debt once again. Please take this with you. Yusaki to unlock the abandoned mine's gate. I'll be waiting for the good news. Try to be careful, alright? Okay, so somewhere in here... So let's see a door... That one. I can't believe they have multiple locks. One for the entrance and then one for here, too. Hmm. See what manner of horrible beasts wait for us. So this is the abandoned mine. It doesn't really strike me as being a particularly old place. I mean, look, the orbital lamps still seem to be in okay sh condition. It's probably just to keep monsters from appearing near the entrance. I get a feeling that this place is used for storing materials and the like. Maybe, but still, this place doesn't sit well with me. It gives me bad vibes. Actually, this would be the perfect place to test your metal, you know? Happy-go-lucky as always. We're here on work, not some random dare, remember? Heh, <laughs> don't have to tell me twice. I can detect the presence of multiple monsters deeper in. The structure of the mine will likely get more complex the further we go. We should proceed with caution. Absolutely, let's try not to get lost while we're at it. Sorry, a chest nearby? It's that monster. <laughs> Winged ant. They're probably tanky enough that they won't die after one team rush, right? Never mind. Weaklings. Okay, I guess I gotta scan them anyways. Hmm. There's already another entrance. Let's just kill everything and look for the chest. Poison and confusion? Seriously, why is everything here... A lot weaker than I thought, huh? It's more than half their hit points. Hmm, level 23. They should be about the same as me then. And yet, my new weapons must be really overpowered for now. Oh well, the enemies will catch back up in a few dungeons anyways. Meantime, I'm gonna need more water, Sepe. Yes. Seriously. Do they respawn if I leave or go into a different map? They shouldn't if I'm supposed to exterminate each and every one. Hmm. Oh no. 
The bat sees me. Ha! Shoot. Team Rush. I have a lot of battle scopes now. Might as well use it. Grave Bat. Oh no. That's right. Flying enemies usually have high evasion. Oh, it got refunded on the battle scope. Nice. Hmm. 100 of each. Mind your own business. But which entrance do I start with? I saw multiple paths. Seems like I might have to go into one of them to get down to the other areas, too. Should I take the lower one first? I have to go through all of them at some point, right? Yeah. Let's try the lower one first. Ah, another chest. This time, higher element Sephiroth. Did you hear about the woman who had a craving for Goldia Sephiroth? She just wanted some space, man. A snail. These guys should be fairly tanky compared to the others, right? Oh my goodness! I need to use arts on them, don't I? That or just encouragement. Very flexible shell. Hmm, just in case I can't kill them in time, let's crash bomb. That is amazingly tanky. They're weak to win. Do I have win? No. Dark matter. That's my answer to everything. You dark matter as well. Let me pull to the center here, eh? So this should be a safe spot. Yikes. Brave Smash. Oh, wow, I petrified one. Nice. This should be the end for you. Nice. Nur Ant. What the? Why didn't... Why did they... Not get stunned. Ah, shit. Not good. Okay, keep going. Actually, let's return to the upper part first. Apparently, they want the guide wanted me to go there first for a defense-free gem, a defense-free court. Okay, so this really will lead to defense-free. We'll see. And our ant. Randy learned war cry. What does that do? It's Wild Rage, but rebranded. Okay. Hmm. Okay, seems to have returned to a pre previous area in the 
old room. Hmm. Oh shoot. Let me kill- there's a chest- there should be a chest nearby, come on, just get past this guy. What's in here? EP charge. Yeah, I am way out of order here. Ah. Got to read this chest. Just think, if you spent less time harassing chests, you could have already finished this support request. Okay, this should be Gladiator Headband. You're, you peer deep inside the chest once again, only to bump your head against the lid as you stand back up. Serves you right. Okay, there, let's see what goes what's deeper in this mine. Yeah, we're in the ch map with no chests in it right now. And this one has two chests. Okay. There's no monsters, though. Weird. Reviving Balm. Your request for a rare ultra-powered quartz room before the Septian calendar is being processed. Please stand by. Yes, yeah, so, uh, I think every uh, uh, every arc has one. Uh, has some way of getting ancient uh, 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 ancient courts. Carry a bomb. I'll let you in a little secret. There was more than one item in here, but someone beat you to it and took the good stuff. The bad stuff? You're holding it. Hmm. Wait, there's nothing on this side. Oh, what the? A secret room. The heck? Okay. Monster chest. I better prepare. Here goes. Oh yeah, they... Yeah, we're gonna have to assume everyone's gonna head our way. And she's gonna cast after everyone starts moving. So hmm, how far can these guys move anyways? Let's put it right here just to be safe. I don't think they can get behind me too easily anyways. Let them whack... Ow. Oh shit, they can hit really hard. Why did that one not move? Courage. Crash bomb as many of you as I can. That will ease the pressure a bit. Now get into the circle. Why are some just some some of them just standing there? That is so weird. What kind of weird behavior is this? Punch anyone who- oh no, he got behind me again. I really need to make Dark Matter hit behind me too. Yes. Oh hey, the one behind me got sucked in? Really? Good. Serves them right. Brave smash here. Oh, I missed one. Why are some of them just staying in the back? Seriously. This is a glitch. And this time I will hit behind me too, so that none of you can escape my wrath. Yes, this should hit everyone no matter where they attack me from. Now you're moving. Okay, craft salamander. Narrow one down.
Okay, last one. And win. Battle boots. How do those compare to my current shoes on every one? Evasion up and a good defense boost. Hmm. Stragus and then Sprinters. I want to keep on him. This rate, Randy's going to have the lowest defense out of everyone, huh? Yeah, so put this on you. Evade tank better. Remember when you didn't have to check the treasure chest twice? Ah, those were the days. Okay, now I need to look for everything else. I'm not done yet since there's no announcement that I kill all the monsters. This room should be monster free. Hmm. Gotta retrace my steps somehow. Hmm. No, it was right here. Really wish it'd give us a proper dungeon mini map. That's right, there's still two more here. That one. This room is good. No. Okay, the last one is a chest is in sight. No. Okay, this should be the last mob. I hope. Oh no, don't teleport me out. That's the last of them. Yes, it should be. I can't detect any more monsters within the abandoned mine. Phew, finally. Running around this ugly place has tuckered me out. We definitely worked hard. Now, Lloyd, shall we head on back to Mayor Bixen's house? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna make it. Lloyd, do a palace all and carry me back to the entrance, please. Not gonna happen. And we're not done here. We need to get to the chest. Stop messing around. Send it head back. Killjoy. Cancel. Oh, I'm still near the other chest. No, I got bumped all the way back. Right, then. Defense free. I'm not empty, I'm making a statement. Who should get it? Hmm, Ellie would be a good choice, probably. Oh no, I have to upgrade that slot first. I could put on Lloyd, but the problem is... That would cut into his offense a bit. Hmm. Turn. So you managed to get rid of all those pesky monsters. Yes sir, they won't be an issue anymore. For the time being, no further monsters should try to settle in that area. The remaining miners should be safe to work during the festival, at least until the rest of the mining crew returns. That's music to my ears, I must find some way to thank you. Oh, uh, how about this? Whoa. That's a lot of each sepeth. That's- that is a lot of sepeth. Whoa, 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 you sure you're allowed to give us this mountain of sepeth? You're play, pulling your leg, right? Mayor Bixen, I'm not sure if it'd be appropriate to accept an award like this. This seems more suited for bracers. Besides, isn't sepeth a valuable export from your mines? We can't take so much of it away from you, can we? Please, you're overthinking this. Sepeth is, is merely fragments of septium, you know? It's the freebie we get while binding septium, in a, in a ma manner of speaking. The government may regulate what we do with Septium, but they couldn't give a hoot about what we do with Sepeth. 
Honestly, I wish I could have given you more than what I did. It's always nice to get step up off my hands. I never thought about it like that. <laughs> In a way, you, you're all helping me by accepting this. Please, allow me to give this to you as a token of my appreciation. If you say it's okay, we'll gladly take it. Good, man. Before you leave, I'd like to thank you one last time. Thank you, everyone. You folks never disappoint. Did well taking care of those monsters in that abandoned shaft. It seems I'm once again in your debt. Until we meet again, everyone. You all saved the town. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. Hey, Worfs, where are you up to? Colin suddenly insisted we go to look at the attractions in the harbor district. Poor kid wore himself out yesterday and ended up wanting to go home. Heh, <laughs> the little rascal never learns. Oh, Colin, I wonder where you heard about tourist attractions. Something feels off. I'm a little worried. The crowd is larger than usual today. I met a man who came from really far away yesterday. He said he was going to have fun at the harbor. I don't know what he meant, but I want to have fun there too. I think I should look into this. Hmm. Okay, so this message really changed? Is celebrating the anniversary festival underneath the bell of Crossbell weird or the most appropriate way to celebrate Crossbell imaginable? Hmm, I wonder if the other chests in the city area changed. Actually, no, I, they won't let me teleport from here. What a shame. Yep, this one changed. Happy birthday, Crossbell. It's Usher, Xbox 360 sound. Please close my lid. Can you see how much confetti I'm collecting? You changed too? I tried to jo go join the festivities too, but... I kind of got lost in the B sector. Are you up to anything? Oh, this is the last straw. I'll show you, type seriously. What's got John Stir so fired up? Who knows? Either way, it's easy to see that Jonah has put on his serious face. Yeah, that much is clear. I just hope he's not getting himself into trouble. No one breaches my system and gets away with it. Ren did it, didn't she? Unacceptable. Type seriously. You know, now that I've had a chance to soak in the sights, the rural scenery here is lovely. You can say that again. Didn't have much type of a chance to really check it out last time, considering we had monsters to take down. I suspect this location would prove a perfect setting for a countryside picnic. <laughs> However, there's a big probability nearby monsters would ruin our fun. Still though, I bet it'd be really fun to drive down this road. Traders like Mr. Hayworth probably know the ins and outs of Crossbell like the back of their hand. I'm sure they do. I bet we could take a great photo of this place for Grace's article. Do you mind taking a few photos for us, Ellie? Oh, I see. I actually ran to a location for the photo side quest. Not at all. Don't expect a masterpiece from me, though. Just relax, Elle. You just gotta peek through the, that lens, give it a little click, and bam, we good. If only capturing a great photo were that simple. You need to pay close attention to your composition to ensure you've captured everything in frame. The weather, wind speed, and lighting can completely alter the impression the photo gives. There are no second chances when it comes to picture-perfect uh, moments. The difference in quality between amateur and professional photography is immediately apparent. I would imagine a simpleton would have, a diff have difficulty grasping any level of intricacy of or nuance, however. Damn, Teotot, you implying something? Calm down, everyone. We should let Ellie focus on taking the photo. Right, I'll try to live up to your expectations. Boo, there we go. I took a few couple of extras just in case. Hey, looks like you pulled through. Well, how did they turn out? I don't have an answer for you until I've seen the developed photos. At the very least, I think they'll get the job done. I wouldn't screw up the quest. It would be a safe assumption to think Ellie has regained her photography skills. Well, I'm no picture-taking guru, but I'm sure they turn off fine. Right, we should keep our eyes peeled for other scenic locations we can take picture photos of. But anyway, let's get a move on. Okay, so this is the Sephith Demon. Okay. I don't know, down, maybe... I'm a team guard. Oh, 
Crash Bomb. Okay. Analyze. They do not have a lot of resistances. They have a lot of defense, don't they? Let's do another Encourage. Hmm, Blue Hammer. Support only of a reflex. Hmm. Not bad. Brave Smash. Oh, we sealed it. Oh no, Flaming Frog, uh, Flaming Breath, huh? Hmm. Summon Zite. Okay, power smash on you. No, actually, I should try to... Uh, I'm not <laughs> too far away now. Oh well, if I can finish off one, that'd be great. Okay, where's Adamantine Guard? Drop another blue hammer. Brave smash. And this one's a saying duck. Did they even take any damage yet? Heh. <laughs> Blue drop. Buff again. Okay, art. 
Oh no, down. Don't want you recovering from seal too quickly. What else are you weak to? Wind appar is apparently pretty good against you. Let's use Spark Dine. Get my CP up. That was pretty easy. Burn times two. Exterminated monster on Armorica Old Road. Hmm. Wait, did the monster notice me while I was fighting? Weird. I, I keep hearing that ding noise. Maybe a glitch. Huh. Get what's happening. This drome here was replaced by the boss monster, but yet it's it still existed in a way and still noticed my party, plus making the ding sound. That was weird. Okay, here's another photo spot. I might as well just do all of the non battlefield ones now, and then just and once I'm at the battlefield, I can get it over with. Armorica villages fields and apiary are beautiful as ever. Crossbells is steam farming village. Grace's tourist guide might benefit from a landscape shot of this. It's picture perfect, that's for sure. Due to Armorica's clean air, it's easy to see from far away. This may very well be the only place in Crossbow that you can witness such a beautiful, untainted sight. If only there were farmers working in the fields for a picture. This spot would make a nice photo for Grace's article, Farmers or Not. Will you do the honors, Ellie? Okay, leave it to me. Ooh, I hope they turned out okay. Nice, Ellie. You look pretty. Co you look pretty confident taking that picture. Shall we move on? Hmm. Still not saying anything. Also, for some reason, this is an area where I can take a picture. Um. Somewhere here. Yeah. Sheesh. Safety hazard. Much. There ain't even a fence. I really doubt anyone would be standing on the edge of a cliff like this in the first place. Look, you can see the bottom of the valley from here. Quite the drop, isn't it? If you stare for too long, it starts to feel like it's sucking you down into it. It's not a very pleasant feeling. This is a cemetery, after all. Perhaps someone from the other side is beckoning you to join them. Do you really have to phrase it like that, Tio? Well, putting the supernatural aside, this spot would make a nice photo for Grace's article. Will you do the honors, Ellie? Okay, leave it to me. I hope they turned out okay. Nice, Ellie. You look pretty confident taking that picture. Shall we move on? The site never becomes any less impressive. I was not aware Crossbow had such an amazing waterfall. It's really confusing because this spot was is really close to the fishing spot. This photo spot. Yeah. Yeah, so this is one of the Crossbow's landmarks. It would be hard pressed to find a waterfall this grand in our country. I bet. It gives off such a souping vibe. Next time someone talks about clean, cleansing their heart and mind, I know exactly where to send them. Ooh, should we meditate under the waterfall? We can do the hums and everything. As the cascading water crashes onto one garden's a soul loincloth, only then will the door to enlightenment be opened. Poetic, but I think I'll pass. I'd rather vomit and picture you in the loincloth, thank you very much. <laughs> come on, Tio Tot, don't be shy. Putting that idea aside, this spot would make a nice photo for Grace's article. Will we do the honors, Ellie? Okay, leave it to me. Whew, I hope they turned out okay. Nice, Ellie. You look pretty confident taking that picture. Shall we move on? Okay, there's a spot all the way here. 
Near this tower. Hmm. It's called Moon Temple. What is with these ruins? They look dilapidated. I think it's the ruins of a temple built during the Middle Ages. Whatever the details are, the CGF doesn't want anyone entering, judging by the barricade. The same as Stargazer's Tower. No reason to go trespassing. Still, it's quite the view, isn't it? Hmm, I bet we could take a great photo of this area for Grace's article. We do the honors, Ellie. Okay, leave it to me. Whew, I hope they turned out okay. Good job, Ellie. You look like you're getting the hang of it again. And now we've managed to meet Grace's five photo quota. Let's run these by her when we get a chance. No, we need to take more. Okay, here's an area. So this big old body of water is the Lupinus River, eh? What's that thingy flowing all the way out in the middle supposed to be? A shrine? I'm going to guess it's some, there's some old ruins. The database contains no details either. The only information I found was that the entry is prohibited. I can't speak to the ruins' origins, but I heard people refer to it as a matchmaking shrine. If a man stands on the left of the observation platform and then a woman to the right, they can give their vows and live happily ever after. I don't know about that, L. That sounds like an old wife's tale. Hmm, I bet we could take a great photo of this area for Grace's article. Will you do the honors, Holly? Okay, leave it to me. Ooh, I hope they turn out okay. Nice, Ellie. You look pretty confident taking that picture. Shall we move on? The monster on this platform disappeared? Weird. I am not ready for these things. Level 25, my ass. A reflex. Adam and Team Guard. A reflex self. Okay, steal that turn. Now, move. A reflex self. A reflex self. A reflex self. This is seriously a messed up battle. Oh, it's focusing his power. Great. There goes our shield, son.
Ow. Takes too long to cast Calamity Claw. A reflex. No. Can't cast it in time. Just kill this one fucking guy. Move Ellie out of the way so we can revive her later. They switched tactics? can't win like this. Gonna have to let him... Gonna have to let Randy die here. I was close. Yes. I'm a team guard. God damn, they're way too fast. Gonna have to let Randy die again. <laughs> Reviving bomb on Randy. <laughs> or not. I'll scope. A reflex on him.
move. Damn it. Have to let Ellie die here, huh? Yes. Damn it, this guy is just too fast. This battle is pretty fucked up. Really should come here way later. Seriously, revived characters take way too fucking long to heal off. It sucks. He reflects on you. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna use up all my reviving bombs for this one fucking guy, huh? Okay, this time everyone just run. Wow, we don't have any more steam left for that one. Let's use EP charge then. Move. Move. Okay. So, Ellie, you definitely don't have it. Okay, a reflex on Tio. There. Oh no, drive again. Magna Blaze. Wow, we suck at this. Seriously, even with our speed this maxed out, we are still casting way too slow for this guy, huh? Oh boy. For speed advantage, hopefully I can get my A reflex off in time. Yes, I can. Ellie, just keep casting fire so we can pull off a miracle victory. Okay. Uh. 
uh, art, compassion. Die. Even if you're 50% heal, it was not enough to overcome all the reflected damage. Ow. That was a pretty humiliating fight. But I got the Capricorn gem. Wait earlier than I was probably supposed to. So what exactly does this thing do? Effectiveness of e hit point EP recovery items multiplied by two. Nice. Let us never do that again. Cassidy, what are you saying here? Haven't you checked your work out schedule? Today's leg day, not chest day. Okay, there's something here. Yes, the photo one. The photo event. Stargazer's Tower. It's been a while since we fought Yin here. On second glance, this place sure is beautiful, isn't it? From the outside, absolutely. From the inside, not so much. Wouldn't it be smart to conduct an investigation of the entire tower one these days? Leaving mysteries like this unchecked always leaves an unsavory feeling in my mouth. Considering the place is under the CGF's jurisdiction, that might be easier said than done, Tio Tot. On top of that, you'd have to get the permission of a dumbass who won't allow anything that doesn't earn him a promotion. Well, with all these problems to deal with, we'll never get bored. Anyway, this spot would make a nice bow for Grace's article. Will you do the honors, Ellie? Okay, leave it to me. Phew, I hope they turn out okay. Nice, Ellie. You look pretty confident taking that picture. Shall we move on? Okay, there's spot number eight, the Transcontinental Railroad. Yup, the thing connects Erebonia to Calvert, all while running smack dab through the middle of Crossbell. Damn impressive when you think about it. Freight trains are also used to transport goods in and out of the state. It wouldn't be a stretch to say that the railroad symbolizes modern day Crossbell. It's too bad we can't take a picture of the train to give the grace. It would have made for something really spectacular. Mm, what's up, Tio? It would seem a train is approaching after all. How miraculous. Wait, real? Seriously? That's friggin' sweet, man. I think it's time for that picture-perfect moment, L. Get the camera, Ellie. Okay. There it goes. Whew, that may have been the first time I've seen a moving train up close and personal like that. How'd it go, Ellie? Well, it was a moving object and it was a bit rushed, but um, I think I'll get the job done. Oh really? Well, you managed to pull, up the, uh, pull up the camera out pretty quickly, so we owe you one. Anyway, let's get a move on. Let's turn in what I have so far. Okay, that's for mine monster cleanup, soccer, and the monster road thing. Still gotta wait on day four in order to finish off the photo quest. And I still have that mandatory quest for counterfeit exposing. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this Let's Play of The Legends of Heroes Trails from Zero, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.